We are in Washington, D.C., and we're looking at a 1915 Model T Ford. And this is a car that has actually driven from Detroit to San Francisco. Right now, it's uh, part of the Historical Vehicle Association. And it's going to be used to lead the connected your, uh, car convoy. Jim? Jim, this is Casey. Hey, you know how are you? Is this a matching numbers car? Yeah, yep. This is a matching numbers 1915 Model T Ford. Yep. And it drove all the way uh, from Detroit to San Francisco, yep. right? It took us around 35 days. We did 3,700 miles across America on dirt roads and back roads following Edsel Ford's route that he took in 1915. And I understand you only had one flat tire. One flat tire <laughs> and that was about it. That was actually one of the big Achilles heels of cars of this era. They had a lot of blowouts yep. and punctures. Absolutely. Which is why they sometimes carry side mount tires. Not this one, but a lot of cars yeah, of this well, era. Yeah, well we have one over oh, here. Oh, you have it over there. <laughs> and I've got a tube tire. under the back seat. Yeah. Well, it's, it's funny because even though this is such an old car, it's a 100-year-old car. It is symbolizing a very modern thing here, which is the connected car, and cars are going to be connected, driving autonomously and all that. That's what this uh, car parade here is all about. It's the 2016 Washington Auto Show collected, uh, connected car convoy. And um, there's a lot of legislation that's coming out of Washington that is about connected cars and autonomous cars and the spectrum that they'll need to communicate and vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle communications and a lot of that. Uh, this Model T Ford is before cars even had radios, so they're not worrying about that too much. All right, well, I'm going to ride to the Washington Auto Show from the Rayburn House office building here in D.C. in this lovely Model T Ford.